What'd you just do? Make sure our sewer hose fit. Let's go peek around the side. Is anybody over there? No. Okay. Like Did you dump anything? No. Oh. Do I need to? I thought we needed to dump the gray. Why are you looking like <laughs> I don't know. I didn't mean to. This is the first time we've had a site where we actually have a little sewage black water dump right there. Matt was worried last night that our hose wouldn't fit, but it does. Yay! Mushroom? Um, I want to get something to cover that. without a leash over there. So we're hitting up New Braunfels today. What? We're going to New Braunfels. Oh my gosh! <laughs> <laughs> that was not on purpose. Marble Falls! Holy crap! How was that not on purpose? <laughs> that was I, a bad one. <laughs> I feel like I'm home. I think that's it. I we feel like I'm home. Yeah. And so, like, Marble Falls is our equivalent to New Braunfels today. Weird! I have problems. Are you going to oh say? What? This is a legit house. What the heck? I mean, there's tables out front, but this is. Hi. So, this is the coffee shop in a house. The jewelry place? We'll probably have to come by one more time. Uh, he's, both of them were under contract, the ones that I spoke to. It happens. Hmm. We don't do contracts. Oh, sorry. <laughs> stopped at a grocery store here in Marble Falls and surprisingly they had a lot of plant-based vegan options which I found quite interesting. So I picked up our usual the protein nut milk, some cashew milk, waters. We're not using the water here. They said that they're on a well but we said to bring your own because people prefer it. We got some Coke Zeros. I had this little snack pack because I was hungry but I ended up eating something else. Cold brew, greeny beanies, Matt's on a hot dog kick, so we get more hot dogs. I'm on a hummus kick, so I got more hummus. Zucchini and yellow squash that's already cut, because I always buy this stuff, but I'm too lazy to cut it. So this is nice and convenient. Got some wheat thins. Rice cauliflower, which I might try in some oats. I've seen some people doing it in oats. We'll see. Uh, brown rice. Got some biscuits, because I'm going to do biscuits and gravy in the morning. Sandwich pockets. Rice rollers, which these are, I guess, like a just a rice cake, but different shape. It's kind of cute. 
seitan, which is a great, great protein source, and a peanut butter chocolate protein bar. I don't know if there's going to be enough room for it, but i say we had a pretty good morning successful for you. It was good for me. Maybe not so much for Brady. You had fun, I think. He just gets bored. So I'm going to put this away and then we're going to make lunch. For everybody that assumes that Matt's healthy eating just because he's vegan. Nachos and hot dogs. Yeah. <laughs> but I'm also just trying to finish some stuff out of the fridge, so don't judge would me too hard. Would you have chosen a salad instead if we needed to finish the greens? I would have chosen the salad to move it to get out of the way to get other stuff behind it that was hot dogs. That's nachos. what I thought. <laughs> yeah, so no. And what'd you have for dinner last night? Nachos. What'd you have for lunch yesterday? Uh-huh. <laughs> I rest my case. This is better than TV, isn't it, Brady? Unlike the same. Yep. Who is it? Put it thin down. What are they saying? More people. What? More people. What? <laughs> what? Game changer. Oh, there's more people! <laughs> so close to the window. Want to see two? I don't think Buzz cares. And there's that thing. He just wants the pits. Yeah. Brady, what do, you, what do you say we give the neighbors some privacy? Look! Matt's having pizza and mac and cheese tonight! Green! Green! I've already had a bunch of greens, okay? What's that doing on there? I don't know. Look at mine. Oh, Beans and zucchini and coleslaw and hummus. Oh, yeah. So I've got a homemade, it's like a garlic mushroom gravy that I kind of just throw things together and hope it works and I tasted it and it's really good plus some biscuits in there brown I know it's all, that's your food everything brown. is brown brown coffee brown biscuits notice the legs are completely <laughs> off the couch what? Brady. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I wanted this whole time. Bring me the camera. Oh my gosh. Eventually. I wish we had an exciting update for y'all on all the cool things that we did today. I took a nap. He sort of took a nap and we had some snacks and watched a movie after I worked out. Yeah. It's like once I get into the mood of just resting, then I'm good with just chilling. Partially with this lifestyle as well. Yeah, I was gonna say, sometimes, you know, we're busy during the week, and we work hard during the week, and on weekends, sometimes I just want to do nothing. So we ended up not going to the Longhorn Caverns. Apparently they stopped doing tours at 4. It's now 4.30, so that's out the window. But we're gonna go to the pool now. I don't know. I don't know. Our life is boring. boring. Maybe we just quit YouTube. Ooh. Done. Bye, guys. That's okay. Good morning guys, so we are starting the process, packing everything up. We are. We're hoping to head out probably around 10, between 10 and noon. Yeah, people left. Do you realize that? Mm-mm. Three large, at least. Dang. It looks these. super early. Is that when you're supposed to do it? I don't know. Check out is, oh, 11 a.m. So you can't even stay till noon. For tonight, um, we always go to my parents to watch Game of Thrones, and she asked us to bring a couple things, so... Rather than pack everything up, go home, unhook, unpack, like that, it's a very long and hot 
and tiring process. And rather than do all that and then have to go to the store, I was thinking we could go this morning and then, you know, once we get home and unpacked and everything, then we can just chill until we go over there. Basically today we're just packing up and leaving. Nothing crazy exciting. But of course yesterday we didn't really do anything either, which is nice though. I mean, I feel yeah. like most of the people that come to RV parks come here to do that. And this being so new to us, we still just kind of want to just chill, you know, because we're normally on the go all the time in San Marcos. And so whenever we come here, it is kind of like a little mini vacation. Yet we still got all of our work done and Matt has a couple sales possibly yeah. coming from this. So we will see y'all on the road. You guys, this place, this... We even have some of the newer movies. So this place is active. Yep. Well, not, this is also their Baptist church Let's right here. burn it. Really? Yeah. In, uh, in commission? I mean, I guess so. Yeah. Wow. I know, it's strange, right? I mean, that's kind of cool. Professional what? sharpening, computer service right repair, and DVD rental. Small town burn it. He's loaded up. There's baby boo. Are you candy? Buzz, buzz. Buzz, buzz. You guys ready? Are you? I think we're ready to go. Everybody ready? Make sure it comes the controller. with us. I always like to look around to see if anybody's flagging us down. <laughs> Bye, Lake. Detail. Well, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, good time at Big Chief. Uh, there's a lot of uh, pluses and minuses there. We uh, we actually had a pool for the first time. That was pretty amazing for uh, for me, at least. The trailer sites were nice. We only had one tree, so I didn't get to really put up my <laughs> hammock and things like that. But most people don't even need that. It was uh, it was a good time. We didn't get to go Longhorn Caverns, but we we still had plenty to do, and we actually were able to relax some too as well. It was nice. Yeah, it was pretty nice. Keep me things safe. Anything to add? What was your favorite part? My favorite part was where where it was by the lake, and it wasn't expensive, right? No, it was we cheap. ended up paying. Uh, it was like around 150 for five nights. The premium site. Oh, another favorite was that there was a sewage dump at each campsite. Yeah, also so never had that. That's that's new for us, so I really enjoyed having that, so we didn't have to load up or even use our, our poop trolley, which we did bring just in case. I would definitely recommend it. It's right in the Texas Hill Country. Keep in mind that it is in an area with not a lot of big towns around. Marble Falls is a decent size, but they're small towns, so I mean, a lot of people like that feel. You know, you travel and you want to go to the small towns and go to the local businesses and things like that. So it is a great area for that. It's near at least two lakes. Um, and there's always a lot of stuff going on in the summertime there. So if you ever get a chance, go over there for 4th of July because they always have a huge firework display off of Lake LBJ. Um, we usually try and go with my family every year. But yeah, it was a lot of fun. Yeah, it's a good time. And no longer in caverns, which is one, hey. one thing that was on our list, but you, know, you can't always do everything. So, But thank you guys for watching, and I'm already ready to plan our next trip. I'm already planning our next trip. It's, it's done. We're going to go for a week? In several days. Maybe not a full week. Let's see. How about we go somewhere after that, too? I guess we, I'm not done planning our trip. Planning our next trip. So thank you guys for watching. If you did enjoy it, make sure and hit that thumbs up. If you have any questions, leave them below, and that's going to be it for today. Have fun out there. Bye.